The new look office building is powered by 189 solar panels, which significantly reduces greenhouse gas emissions and reduces the collective dependence on fossil fuel. The solar panels supply the building with 90 kilowatts of energy, relieving the resident agencies and authorities from relying on fossil-generated electricity for their needs, including lighting ICT, water pumping and temperature control. The building, currently co-resided by the program and provincial agricultural bodies, will be transferred over to the East Sipic Provincial Administration at the end of the program and will continue to provide a sustainable base for sustainable support to agriculture-related services in the province. Officiating the opening ceremony, Ambassador Janay Videtish, head of the European Union delegation to PNG, in his address says he was happy to see that things are moving in the right direction to bring sustainable benefits to the people of East Sipic. The East Sipic Acting Deputy Provincial Administrator James Baloiloi expressed his appreciation to the European Union for funding the EU Strait PNG program and the interventions that the program is doing in East Sipic and Sundown provinces. Thanking the European Union for its generous funding support, Dr. Shubin Sun, the EU Strait Program Coordinator, said the new climate-friendly facility, which is fully powered by solar energy, also provides a space to welcome, advise and serve the farmers, including interested women and youth, who play very important roles along agri-food value chains. Thanks for watching TV1 News. Please like and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell to stay up to date with the latest news.